Nemesis X object. Original ho it's the original home world of Homo and Nuna when it, Luna, Earth, Phoenix, the Dark Satellite, and Electra all orbited Nemesis, not Sol. This was prior to the Cataclysm. Nephilim. Nephilim were mighty men of old, men of renown. Homo and Nuna were titans. They were the survivors of the Gihon Flood, 34-39 BC. They took the daughters of men, Adamu, who were the indigenous Near Eastern uh, races, and they fathered what the Adamu considered to be hybrid offspring who were much, much larger and more powerful than the indigenous offspring, uh, native stock. Genesis 6 isn't about angels having sex with human women. That's the religionist perspective. That's what AIX wants, wants to tell you. <coughs> no. Homo and Nuna, yeah, it, it's, it's purely racial. Anyway, Nur. Anunnaki Nur is a period of 600 years well known in ancient times that began with the Nemesis Cataclysm in 5239 BC. Nodal Aperture. Disguised projectors in the stellosphere of the Smilacrum. We refer to as variable stars that actually project energy in concert to produce phenomena experienced in the biosphere. Yes, you're going to learn. I got variable stars on this list too. This is a nodal aperture. They're hidden in the sky. Thousands of little miniature projectors that produce phenomena. NPC. NPCs are optical and audio coded distractions introduced by archons in proximity to errands. Never close, but never too far away. They are purely edited in our existence for distractions or to keep us from noticing something else. NPCs are not just people. They are phenomena. They're often objects and even moving vehicles. Oxygen. Oh, oxygen. I said oxygen. Ogaijin Deluge. The Ogaijin Deluge. The Flood of Ogaijis. In 1687 BC, it was the collapse of worldwide civilizations by Phoenix, initiating a 25-year darkness, which was a temporary return of the vapor canopy conditions. And a new wave of giantism occurred. And this is found in the historical record. Because right after this began the Age of Heroes in ancient Greece and Achaia and Argos and Mycenae. It led to the, the Seven Against Thebes, Jason and the Argonauts, uh, and the famous War for Ilium, the Fall of Troy, which had giants on the battlefield. Oversoul. Unknown first cause that communicates to enlightened souls by intuition, empathy, and imagination, and is not active in, nor is it restricted by, the simulacrum. That's the oversoul. We don't know who or what or she, what she is. Palindrome. A repetitive series of data equidistantly forward and backward from an epicentral point of reference. All my research is based on historical palindromes. I have many videos about that. Parable, a narrative that serves as an image of truth, not the truth itself. Just like you are living in a copy of a real universe, not the real universe itself. Paradigm, a worldview that has been accepted, a set series of concepts that have been accepted as fact. That's your paradigm. Phoenix Cycle. Ancient 552-year period widely known. It is four periods of 138 years. Phoenix, like Phoenix years. But virtually erased by the Roman papacy when they invented the Anno Domini calendar. I have a video about that. It's harrowing. They erased that calendar. They created a new calendar. And they covered up all their mistakes. Phoenix. Subject of many of my videos. Also called the Fink, the Fing, the Fenris, Typhon, Typhonius, Noth, Sky Dragon, the Doom Shape. So many names. Ingenious benefactor protocol disguised as a cataclysm protocol that neutralizes activity and the work of the Archons and their agents, the elite. 
That's the Phoenix. It is a benefactor protocol. Post-technolithic. It is the period following the exodus of the Anuna in 2647 BC when ordinary humans appropriated their technology but with inferior skill. It is a 408 year period that ended with the Great Flood in 2239 BC. This is the post-technolithic period. The gods disappeared before a great cataclysm, left behind their technology and their hardware. Regular humans Pri priorly their servants took over the technology and also started building great things but everything was much inferior to the technolithic uh, ruins that we have found post-technolithic ruins are done with the same equipment but inferior skill 